obviously, uh, you guys are down 18 at one point in time, all the way back, and you get up the win. What, in your mind, was the biggest catalyst for the comeback? Um, the defensive side, I feel like um, we let up too many points in the first half, probably like 40. I don't remember how much they had in the first half, but it, it was just um, we weren't playing defense in the first half, so that was our main focus coming into the second half, sitting down, stopping, and then just chipping at the lead slowly but surely. What do you learn as a team when maybe it doesn't all come back at once? It is having to take it in chunks, having to answer little runs, having to just kind of go almost like timeout to timeout, huddle to huddle, and coming back the way you did. Um, it's, I mean, good experience for us, um, just knowing that we can fight and fight and come back in and take away those, those huge deficits that we um, build ourselves into. Um, but, I mean, we got to really um, – focus and lock in so we don't uh, be in those positions like, like we were in the night. You've talked before about how, you know, in some of the games you've lost, you've been disconnected and just kind of disjointed as a group. How are you able to stay connected tonight and, and come back? Um, it's, I mean, just trusting this, um, your teammates. And, I mean, we, we've been doing this since the summertime, so we've been building this bond and this, and this chemistry together. Um, throughout, even though we lost a couple of rough ones where it felt like we weren't together, we won a couple of ones where you know, we were together, but we're, we're finally trying to get that mix together. We we're all connected, and we're, um, we're slowly and we're surely finding ways to win the game. What was your thought on uh, uh, Leal's three? You see Galloway start to drive, the ball's going out. You're thinking what? Huge. But I'm thinking on my on my my point of view, I'm thinking trying to get good position just in case he missed. But huge shot. Uh, I mean, I don't get no better than that. Um, not gonna know that, giving us that one point lead, um, just giving us that, that cushion that we need to um, just get a stop on our day end, which we did. Um, battle um, gave it up, and then you know, we got fouled at the end, and um, knocking out them two plus free throws also. I mean, huge game by him, and um, giving huge props for that. So what are the, some of the conversations like with you guys in the huddle, timeouts on the court to kind of stay, stay together, stay in the game when you guys are down, and just able to, you know? Put it all together again. Yeah, it's um, trusting in each other. That that was a huge thing. And also, um, just taking it one um, one possession at a time, um, getting those crucial stops that we needed down the stretch, and, and slowly cutting the lead, and then um, just setting goals throughout the media timeouts. All right, we want to cut it down to ten. All right, we want to cut it down to six. All right, we want to cut it down to. All right, let's tie the game now. All right, now let's get ourselves a chance to win the game. So it was, you know, those type of talks, but it was pretty good. You know? Malik, talk about how surreal it was celebrating after the win and how, how happy you guys were with Combo out of the out there. I mean, it's huge. I mean, you had the crowd against us. Um, they were up 18 going into halftime. So um, it's just huge you know, coming out with that win. Uh, I, just, I, I have no words for it. Man. It was just a great moment at the time. You were pretty visibly frustrated on the court early second half. How were you kind of able to you know refocus and re-energize from there? Um, uh, I just got I just got too passionate with the game. Um, that's some words I wasn't supposed to. Um, told my team my fault, and then just got back on the court and it kept going again. So like you all had lost four out of five today. How does a win like this maybe change momentum for you all moving forward? Oh, uh, this is a huge one, especially um, the deficit that we came down from. Um, I mean, it just builds our confidence up, uh, give us ways, and, and we know we can find ways to win. So. I mean, it's, that's huge. You don't want to get attacked with that. Last like question. That, that was a moment where the team kind of got emotional in the game a little bit. I don't, I don't think the team um, all together got emotional, but I felt like um, I was the reason. Um, I was definitely the reason for that attack. Uh, coming down, so that's something I wasn't supposed to say. Um, ref heard it, teched me up for it, told my team I'm sorry, my fall won't happen again. We got back, called myself down, and it, it didn't happen again. Thanks, Mike.